From first view, you know this house is different. You just have no idea until you step inside. Puss in Boots, kick off your shoes and make yourself at home. This Bay Park home is the cat's house. About 1986, we started the cat construction and um, one thing literally led to the next. Now there's 140 feet of cat path in the cat's house. Ten cats call this home, all of them rescued. Their elevated situation, the gift of a couple of loving, if eccentric, owners. This is where it all began. From the living room, it stretches. We go into our hallway. That's probably the most dramatic area of the cat's house. To the bedroom. They go through the opening here, and there's Elliot. And from the bedroom, the cats have options. They can go in their clubhouse, complete with skull and bones entrance. It means that there's absolutely no mice allowed in their cats only clubhouse. Or they can head back into the living room for some TV time. One thing that's kind of interesting when you have a cat path overhead is that while you're watching television is that fur floats down in the bunks your favorite programs. With cats all over the place, catwalks and fish flakes, this is as close to feline heaven that you're going to find. And it's not just the catwalks, it's the cat art and the cat floor in the kitchen. Bob Walker and Francis Mooney have given their home and lives over completely to the cats. They've written books and been featured in numerous TV shows, even a movie. And it's all happening because they wanted to give their cats a place to play. If you really want to endear yourself to your feline family is make them a catwalk and put them overhead so they can look down on you too. Carlo Cicchetto, Local 8 News.